Hello. Hello. Yes. Hi, this is James Trauma American Police Advisor. How are you? Okay, how can I help you, James? Uh, this call is from potential compensation for you or your family member's medical condition. So all I just need to know, how did it to be you or a loved one ever diagnosed with Parkinson? Oh, it's this, James. Hey, James, it's been a while. I, I, I've i talked to you before. Do you remember? No, I don't remember. You don't remember? We talked all about it, about my brother. He got cancer when he was at Camp Lejeune and died. I told you all about that, remember? Oh, 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 oh I see, oh, I see. So can you please tell me what type of uh, cancer your brother had? Don't you remember we've already talked about this? You were you were telling me that you had a relative. You have a relative who also had cancer, and that's why you're doing this job. You know, because you're def you're fighting for people's Shut rights. Up. You know. What? Shut up. Why are you telling me to shut up, James? Such an evil person, James. Don't you remember talking to me before? <laughs> shut up. Shut up. I guess he kind of knew I was on to him. Maybe. <laughs> Hello. Hello. My name is Brian. How are you doing today? Okay, Brian. How can I help you? Actually, sir, the reason of my shortfall is to make sure that are you receiving your flex card, grocery card, and food stamps right now? What what kind of cards? I, I don't think I've heard of these. Okay. So, can you tell me that, sir? How old, old are you? 59. Okay, that's great. So, sir, can you tell me that? Do you have any kind of health insurance through marketplace, through your state, job, Medicare, Medicaid, anyone? No, I, I have a plan through the marketplace. Okay, that's great. So, so you're perfectly qualified for this program. Now I'm going to transfer my call to my senior supervisor. He will further assist you about three of call benefits. Is that okay? Sure, sure. I'll talk to your supervisor. So please stay on my and here we go. Okay. Thank you so much for making this call. My name is Max Rose for Book Eric. How are you doing today? Okay. Well, actually, sir, we are here to get you to the car for free health insurance and government company that's going to cost no money out of your pocket. So, do you currently have Medicare, Medicaid, VA, or any kind of health insurance at the moment? Are you not? Well, like I told the guy before you, I have a plan on the marketplace. Hello? Hello? Can I talk to a can I talk to a different supervisor? Because he wasn't very bright. The best one. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Okay. Morning. Thank you so much for taking this call. This is Mark. Good evening. Uh, yes. Did, did I speak to you before, or are you a different supervisor? Well, uh, your call just got transferred over to me, and this is the first time I'm speaking with you. Oh, okay. Well, whoever I talked to first, we got disconnected, so the guy was transferring me again. So, I, I just missed the name of the guy, so I wasn't sure if you were the same person or not. <laughs> Well, this is the Mark here, so we are here to get you qualified for government subsidies. We have insurance with affordable care. Do you have any kind of health insurance like Medicare, Medicaid, Tricare, VA? No, I have a plan on the marketplace. I already told the guy that. Okay, yeah, you. So, like, uh, if you see one of your additional benefits, like an rental assistance, your grocery card, your cash bag, you want all these benefits? Yeah, I've got all those, I think. I'm pretty sure I do. Okay. Hello? Hello? These guys suck. <laughs> Didn't even try to verify, just, just disconnected. The first supervisor, who obviously was not the best supervisor, the second guy, he was the best. And he sucks. So, it's alright. They'll call back. We'll do it all over again. It's so weird. They just ask these questions, you give them answers, and then they just hang up. Weird. Ah, well.
Good thing I don't really need help. Hello? Hello? Okay, very good. How can I help you? Let me explain to you the basic reason to call you is that we are upgrading our system in satellite. We just want to check your TV receiver box. Okay. Is it compatible or not with our new satellite location? Okay. By any chance, are you watching TV right now? Is the TV on? Uh, yes, yes it is. Okay, so the TV remote controller is in your hand, right? Um, no, but I can grab it. Hold on just a second. All right. All right. I'm waiting for you. Okay, I got the remote. What do I need to do? Okay. Okay. <clears throat> and sir, you are the account holder. Like you take care of the TV. Uh, bill comes at your name. Like you pay the TV bill. Is that right? Well, I have a joint account to pay the bill, but I'm the one that writes out the check, of course, yeah. Just verify what is the zip code down there. Just verify the zip code. 32202. Yeah. Yes, you got Just it. Just give me a moment. Oh, okay. Let me, ver let me verify. Okay. You said 32202, right? Yes, sir, that's correct. <clears throat> and so just verify me your uh, first name? Timothy. Timothy. Yes. Sir, you know what? Uh, what? I think, I think you're lying to me. About what? My name? About the name you Well, what name is on your account that you have? Because there is somebody else that lives here. What do you think about it? What do you think about it? What do I, I think about... I tell you if you are not that person. Why are you... Verify your details if you are not that person. Because you say that your name is Timothy. Yes. I'm not looking here, the person, that name, Timothy. So why I tell you what I name, I am looking here. Well, I mean, there's... not that person. There's more... About it? There's more than one person that lives here. Who are you trying to reach? Yeah. Okay. What's the name of me? I am looking here about three to four names. What's your last name? If uh, if your last name is matching, then I think you are a right person. What's your last name? Williams. That is wrong. That's wrong. Right. <laughs> I think you're telling me a lie. You're not telling me your real name. That was funny. Anyway, ridiculous. There's so many multiple names I use. Who knows what he had? But he didn't want to play the game. But I love it when they say, you're lying about your name. Well, yeah. Prove it. <laughs> that was so funny. I wonder if... Let me just look real quick. I was trying to see. Let's see. It is a local number, which means they probably spoof somebody's number. So I'm not going to call it back. But, uh, never even got to the fact of which cable company were you calling from, you dummy. Wonderful. No call. Hello? Hello? Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Uh, hi, sir. This is Mark Anderson calling you from Accident Claim Services. How are you doing today? Oh, hey, Mark. How's it going? It's been a while. How you doing? I'm perfect. Oh, what are you doing today? What am I doing today? Oh, I'm just driving home. We had a little bit of a vacation and had a good time and heading back to the house now. How about you? What are you up to? Oh, great, sir. Well, sir, this is just a verification call about compensation money regarding auto accident that happened within the past two years. Do you remember when someone hit you and that was not your fault? 
Well, yeah, I remember that, but I'd rather talk about you. How's your mom doing? She doing good? All right. She's all right? Yes. Did, did, I know she went into the hospital recently. Is she everything okay? It's okay? What about your dad? How's your dad doing? Oh, screw that. You don't want to know about my accident. That was such a long time ago. How's, how's, how's your dad? I love, I love screwing with scammers and pretending like you know them and just checking in on how they're doing. It, it kind of freaks them out a little bit because I don't know what to say. It, it really throws them off their script. Uh, so if, if you get a call from a scammer, try that. No matter what they say their name is, pretend like they're your oldest friend and you hadn't talked to them in years. It's so much fun because it throws them off their script and hey, there's nothing better than that. Hey everybody and thanks a lot for checking out the video. If you like the content, click the subscribe button and hit the bell for notification. Leave us a comment. Let us know what you think. Thumbs up, thumbs down, either way, and we'll catch you all next time.